Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got Beauty Big Bang Skull water decals. They came in this little package like most water decals do. And they've got some instructions on the back. I've had these for a while and I've been dying to play with them. They've got the little plastic, you know, covering over the design. That's to help to protect them while they're in the packaging. And you're just going to cut out the ones you want to use. If you want to just do accent nails or, you know, full mani. And I've pulled that clear pa paper off of it. And now I'm just going to cut them all out. Because I'm looking forward to wearing these. Uh, like I said, I've had them for a while and I couldn't wait to use them. So they're all trimmed out. And... We're going to be using Manisha M's trick, and she always puts a little cotton round that's soaking with water in the bottom of the dish. I'm just using a plastic lid instead of having them float around in, you know, a cup of water or something, and you're having to fish them out. Now that I've tried this, I'm sold. Manisha came up with a really good trick for this. You're going to let these sit for a little while until they start pulling away from the backing. And today, I'm going to be putting them on the white nails. You saw me dip my nail under the cotton round. I wanted to get my nail wet, too, so that this would slide and I could move it around and position it where I wanted it. You're going to want to make sure to get it on your nail and, you know, get it all straightened out where you want it. And then I'm going to take a paper towel and I'm going to squish out some of that water and get up some of that excess water. So that, you know, now it can start really sticking, 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 sticking to the nail. These are gorgeous. I was so, so excited to play with these. I know it's not Halloween or any other, you know, holiday that, you know. But you guys know I dance to my own drum. I do whatever I want. Now I'm going in with some acetone and my cleanup brush and cleaning up the edges a little bit. Now with these water decals, I found that kind of dabbing, for the most part, you can see me dabbing, dab, 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 kind of melt it, break it up, and then kind of pull away. If you just start trying to brush around, it just starts messing up that decal. So I am working on the dabbing method. And once I got it figured out, then I could do my swish with my little brush. But I wanted to be very careful not to, you know, just totally tear up the top of that. Look how cute. I love it. So we're going to go ahead and do this to the rest of the nails. The process is going to be the same. I'm going to wet that nail and then apply this decal. And some of them are a little tricky. You know, they get a little slickery and they start sliding around. But with that nail being wet, I've got time to, you know, play with it and get it where I want it. And, you know, make sure it's all nice and flat. There we go. I'll make sure it's all as good as we can get. That nail is super curvy, so I was really worried about this one. But I just decided to keep mushing it down and flattening it out with my other fingers. Getting some of that water up. Making sure to kind of push it over the edge and wrap it around that tip a little bit. Here we go. We're going to go back in with our acetone and clean up brush. And you also can dab it on the sides where, you know, you don't even have any excess. And that kind of help, helps to melt that decal down to your nail a little bit better. You're going to want to work on that end, on that free edge. Kind of get it wrapped around and up underneath. Doing some little tapping and whatnot. I love water decals. They were probably the first, you know, nail art that I ever did. It was way before stamping and water marbling and all of that. So, you know, I do have have a lot of love for some water decals. They're also really easy to store and you don't, you know, you just, you can get some really gorgeous manicures from some water decals. And for the most part, like if you order them from AliExpress or Wish or uh, Banggood or Beauty Big Bang, you can get them relatively inexpensive. You can just get lots and lots of different designs. Here we go with the next one. 
get a little get a little crazy with it. We're just gonna tap that one down, also just like the other ones. But I'll tell you why I didn't use these when I first got them. As soon as I got mine in, my friend Nora over at NAQ57 did a video using these decals, and I didn't want a back-to-back -back review and do something right behind her. She's amazing, number one. And number two, you know, I know a lot of you guys watch all of our channels, so I put a lot of space between her and mine's. So I'm just, you know, reviving a product that Beauty Big Bang has out there. But I would really highly recommend, you know, going and checking out Beauty Big Bang and seeing all of their water decals and other art stuff because they've got some really cool stuff. These water decals work great. I was really impressed with them. Oops, look at the messy girl getting messy again. So here we go. We're just tidying that one up again. Now you guys know why I, now you see why I always keep lots of paper towels and my mat down because I am a messy girl. And this is another manicure that I will wear for a couple of days and with that white gel polish as my base, I will be removing this manicure with some non-acetone uh, polish remover and then I'll do another design right over the top of it. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Love it, love it. Love when it's easy. And I do this a lot where I turn my hand back to where it's facing me, which now that I'm new, doing this new camera angle, more from like my point of view, you guys can see what it looks like to me. This is about what what y'all are seeing is what I'm seeing. Sometimes I can zoom y'all in a little bit better than I've got you today, but I, was, I knew I was going to be moving my hand around a whole lot, so I wanted to make sure I stayed in frame. And on the ends, I like to just tap, tap, tap it until it melts it away. And it does. It'll just melt that excess decal. love it. These are just so much fun. And there's so many patterns and uh, just, I'm obsessed. You guys know I get hooked on stuff. And I go up under my nail a little bit and try to clean that up with the acetone and the brush. Because I don't like a bunch of thick gunkiness, nothings under my nail. It's just annoying. And it feels, I feel like I catch it on everything. There we go. Tap, tap, tap it just a little bit more. These are so pretty. I'm going to top these off with some sesh feet. My posh is still um, recovering from, you know, thinner and adding more and running it through the shaker. It's all bubbly. So today I'm just going to use sesh feet and seal these in. And since these weren't like foilies or anything, I was able to use just regular polish. I didn't have to use a water base over this one because these are not metallic or hollow or nothing. So there you go. Here's my swatch photo. I hope you enjoyed this one. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. And until next time, be good to yourself.